17 assists a game, which is one of the best totals in the country, but tonight, 27 on 36 field goals. It looked like the ball movement was even better than usual tonight. Would you, would you agree with that? Uh, yeah, for sure. I mean, it's something that we've really been preaching lately and really trying to get better at every day. Um, so it's important for us to keep doing it. Uh, I think it's brought us a lot of success, so it's important to keep doing it. Yeah, we talk about getting back to playing true tribe basketball, and we have been um, the past, what is it, four games now, at, all at home. Um, we've been playing great and great together, more importantly. All at home. Why hasn't it yet? Translate to the road. I mean, you guys trailed this team by 31 on the road. You led by 35 tonight. The contrast is really striking. I think we made some strides um, for sure in practice, and we've had a really good week of practice, and even more than that. Um, so I think now we get a chance to do it on the road. Um, so we kind of had four home games, so it wasn't really a chance to prove it. But uh, I think now we have a chance to prove it, so it's important. Yeah, like he said, I mean, we're all meshing together at the moment. Um, the past 10 days have been excellent in practice and on the floor. Um, just trying to build off that going on the road tomorrow. Uh, Daniel, uh, it seems this year you've kind of taken on the load as being almost the guy for the team as uh, leading scorer. Uh, what has that kind of been for you as a transformation in your game almost? I'm just going out and being aggressive every night. Um, I think. My competitive edge is really coming to light uh, now. Just really want to win. Uh, that's the most important thing is winning. So um, my teammates just keep getting me in the right spots, and I'm just continuing to stay aggressive. Have you ever had just personally a run like you're on now? I mean, the last four games, you're over 60% from the field, over 70% from, from three. I mean, it, those are crazy numbers over a four-game stretch. Um, well, hopefully, hopefully it continues, but uh, I've definitely just been getting in the gym and staying aggressive, and like I said, my teammates have been awesome, so that's, that's made it pretty easy. I mean, are you, are you to the point where everything you look at you think is going in? <laughs> um, I'm pretty confident. I'm pretty confident at this point. It wasn't just the scoring tonight, though. I mean, you had four assists, two blocks, seven rebounds. I mean, it seems like your all-around game is uh, really... Yeah, I'm just trying to do it on all cylinders, um, like Coach says, and that's what he wants out of me, so I'm really trying to just do that. Well, like you and TJ were engaging in some good nature, <laughs> ripping, especially right before the, the, the second half. I mean, you guys held him to 7 of 18 mm -hmm. from the floor. What was the key defensively with him tonight? Uh, he's a really, really good player. Uh, so it was just important to contain him a little bit. We knew he was going to score, but we wanted him to take a lot of shots. And I think we were able to do that. Now, one other thing I wanted to, to ask you, how, how, how nice is it to get that lift on, off the bench from, from Nathan? I, mean, I think he came in in seven minutes in the first half. And seven points, two blocks, a, a couple of assists. He really seems to provide a lift. Yeah, he's been killing it. Um, Second half of the season for him being a freshman. I mean, he's really come alive and given us, like you said, that spark off the bench. Um, Paul, including Connor and Justin and Ollie. I mean, they've all been huge these past four games. Um, but Nate, with his couple blocks and I think he had a couple layups, like he, like you said, um, he really gave us a spark. Yeah, I mean, it's important for us to have depth. Um, and those guys, you know, when they come on the floor, we're not really worried. You know, they're going on the floor. I mean, they're really aggressive and they're really good players. So. Uh, it's important for us to have depth, for sure.